Mitch, and I'm keeping science real today. Now anyone who's ever seen one of those old western movies knows the dangers of quicksand. Some poor guy thrashes around trying to keep from sinking into the weird sand abyss, but the more he moves around, the more stuck he gets. Well, I'm going to show you why you really don't want to thrash around the next time you are caught in the quicksand. Now for this experiment, you're going to, oh, check this out. It's a, it's a whiteboard, it's a mirror, whiteboard, mirror. All right, for this experiment, you're going to need some cornstarch, some water, and then a bowl. All right, now the first thing is you're going to do, you're going to take this cornstarch and you're going to dump it right into the bowl. Next, you're going to go over here and grab some water. Gotta love the water. Now that you've got your water, you're going to come over here and, uh, I like my cornstarch colored. Mix that around a little bit. Okay, now you're going to take the water and pour it in gradually until the cornstarch is about the consistency of honey. Kind of gooey, check it out. It's, it's kind of sticky, it's got that consistency, like I said, kind of like honey. All right, now the question becomes, is this a solid or a liquid? Well, it's a liquid, right? Not so fast. See, check this out. Let me show you something. When I apply some force to the mixture, now it's a solid until I release the pressure. All right, for this next part, I'm gonna lock down this caster. Sometimes I don't know my own strength. Now try this. Slap your hand down into the mixture and it's gonna splatter all over, right? Ooh. Nope, turns right back into a solid. You see, this type of mixture, it's not a solid or a liquid. Or rather, it's, it's both a liquid and a solid. You see, when you apply pressure to the mixture, the long cornstarch molecules trap the water, forming a rigid structure. Release the pressure, and the cornstarch molecules release the water, and it becomes a liquid again. All right, now let me show you something. You're caught in the quicksand, and you're flailing around trying to get out, and it's turning, the force is turning this mixture, turning the quicksand into a solid you can't get yourself out of. The trick is to slowly pull yourself up till you can float on the surface, and then you can proceed to scream for help. <laughs> All right, one final comment. Please do not pour this down the drain. It will clog your sink. Something, something fierce, you've been warned. All right, that's all we have for today, guys. This is Mitch. Remember to check out more cool experiments on keepingsciencereal.com, and uh, watch out for that quicksand. Thank you.